With one click, students on Escambia County school buses will have lab belts to wear on their way to school. All of the newer buses purchased have restraints for not just the driver, but also every student. These first three rows will notice have these straps right here. Transportation Director Eric Fritz says the seats on the newer buses are also a bit taller in height. Fritz says that's just another safety feature. If there were a um, possibility of a, a, a rollover, it would definitely hold them in to the seat. Fritz says both upgrades have been an ongoing effort. With this recent purchase, 80 percent of the 335 bus fleet is now seatbelt equipped. I want to show you the difference between the older buses and the newer buses. This is one of the older ones. It's from 1997. It's being retired this year. As you can see, there are no lap belts on this bus. And when you sit down, there's not much protection here, which is very important when it comes to accidents. Now, this is one of the newer buses that will hit the road this fall. As you can see, there are lap belts on this one. And when you sit down, this part is higher. It's four inches taller. So when students make their way to the bus stop on August 18th, one click will hopefully make them a little bit safer. Reporting from Escambia County, Florida, I'm Hubert Tate for Fox 10 News.